Let's do it again. Skip. Yes, yeah, skip. Pose. Post. Damn it. I'm gonna pose again. Smells like Metaton, yes. Sure it does. Gonna heal turn. Who oh, wants to heal? Eat that. Yes, please. Time for a pop quiz. Hope you brought the keyboard. That's the question. Gonna pose. <laughs> Heal. <coughs> Are you just warming up? Okay. Uh, we're gonna heal turn. Here we are, here we are. Ready? Now, there we go, see? Now we know. We know what to do. Pose! Barely got that last one. Pose. Lights, camera, bombs. Here we go. And we're gonna post again. Oh yeah. Gonna pose. Pose dramatically. Time for our union regulated break. Da, 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 happy break time. That's crazy. Heel turn. Alright, his arms came off, cool. Uh, we're gonna pose. Arms, we need them when you have legs like these. Got it. Right. We're gonna heel turn. Here, last one, there. Perfect. I need to heal. Hey, what's up, Wade is easy. Uh, 
Show must go on. Sure, why not? Oh shit. Here we go. Survive. We're gonna pose. Ooh, drama. Nice. You do another post. So you aren't gonna get hit at all. Oh shit. Got it. Uh, we're gonna. Heal, actually, just in case. 12 is not a good number to be at. Shit. Doing way better than last time. Gonna pose again. I don't know if I'm supposed to hit the heart in order to stay pacifist, but I'm gonna just dodge, because I think dodging works too. Shit. Damn it. Keep dodging. There we go. We're gonna heal turn. Shit, I goofed it. Alright, heal again. Nope, nope, don't do that. Don't do that. Don't throw things at me. And we'll pose again. Shit. Left, 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 and left. And heal. I don't like being at 12. Got it. Can I spare him yet? Jeez. Uh, we'll... We'll close again. we we'll here again? Alright. Sure. Shit, shit. Nope, nope. Hmm. Nope. Nope. Alright, I'll try sparing next turn. The next chance I get. Spare. Damn it. Damn it. Oh, I goofed it again. Nope. Ah. Alright. I don't know what it wants me to do. He's not talking, so it makes me feel like I'm missing something. It smells like Metatone. Uh, boast. Damn it. Say that to you. Pose. Oh, look at these ratings. That's all we needed to do was get the ratings at over a ten thousand. 
the viewer call in milestone. One lucky viewer will have the chance to talk to me before I leave the underground forever. Let's see who calls in first. Hi, you're on TV. What do you have to say on this, our last show? Oh, hi, Metaton. I really liked watching your show. My life is pretty boring, but seeing you on the screen brought excitement to my life vicariously. I can't tell, but I guess this is the last episode? I'll miss you, Metaton. Oh, I didn't mean to talk so long. Oh, no, wait. Wait, blo- <laughs> They hung up already. I'll take another caller. Metaton? Your show made us so happy. Metaton, I don't know what I'll watch without you. Metaton, there's a Metaton shaped hole in my Metaton shaped heart. Ah, I... I see. Everyone, thank you so much. Darling, perhaps it might be better if I stay here for a while. Humans already have stars and idols, but monsters? They only have me. If I left, the underground would lose its spark. I'd leave an aching void that can never be filled. So I think I'll have to delay my big debut. Besides, you've proven to be very strong. Perhaps even strong enough to get past Asgore. I'm sure you'll be able to protect humanity. Haha. <laughs> it's all for the best anyways. The truth is, this form's energy consumption is inefficient. In a few moments, I'll run out of battery power and, well, I'll be alright. Knock him dead, darling. And everyone, thank you. You've been a great audience. Then he exploded. I, I managed to open the lock. Are you two... Oh my god. Metaton. Metaton, are you... Thank god, it's just the batteries. Metaton, if you were gone, I would've... I would've... I mean, hey, it's no problem, you know? He's just a robot. If you messed it up, I could always just build another... Why don't you go on ahead? Can I not go back? I would really like to save now. That fight was a pain in my ass. Okay, let's do something first. Get my cell phone, get a box B, get some CT up in this B. Alright, there we go. Actually, hold on. We're gonna leave one spot open. Just in case I find something cool. I want to save though. Oh, okay. Sorry about that. Let's keep going. Alright, sure. So, you're about to meet Asgore, huh? Uh, you must be... You must be... Pretty excited about all that, huh? <clears throat> You'll finally... You'll finally get to go home. Yes. Elevator. What? Wait. I mean, um, I, I was just going to, um, say goodbye and I can't take this anymore. I, I lied to you. A human soul isn't strong enough to close the barrier alone, cross the barrier alone. It takes at least a human soul and a monster soul. Why are you lying to me? If you want to go home, you'll have to take his soul. You'll have to kill Asgore. I mean, I'm not going to kill him. That's the whole point of this run. I'm sorry. Damn it. Why you lie? Elevator. A sip of water. Cool. cool. 
Save spot, please. A spot for saving? Here we go. Save. <clears throat> elevator. The elevator is in use. Okay. Can't take that. Got it. Got it. Do -do. Do -do -do -do. Okay. It's very silent here. Very black and white. Safe spot. <gasps> hey, I recognize this house. The way is blocked by two padlocks. There's a note attached. Howdy, I'm in the garden. If you have anything you need to get off your chest, please don't hesitate to come. The keys are in the kitchen and the hallway. There's a heart-shaped locket inside the box. Will you take it? Yeah. Get the heart-shaped locket. There's a worn dagger inside the box. Will you take it? I don't have space for it. Carrying too much. Damn it. Okay. Let's find out what the locket does first. Heart locket. Armor. Defense 15. It says best friends forever. I will take that. Put that. Use it. Yes. Put the And then we'll put that away in our fancy cell phone box. Worn dagger. Yes. Take it. What a comfortable bed. If you lay down here, you might not ever get up. Room under renovations. There's one key. A long time ago, a human fell into the ruins. Injured by its fall, the human called out for help. Took the key and put it on your phone's keychain. It's Asgore's journal. All the current pages say, it's a nice day today. The ink is, om is still almost wet king size bed. It's a bureau. There's a Santa Claus outfit inside. It's a clothes drawer. There are robes, button-up shirts, and a pink hand-knit sweater that says Mr. Dad Guy. It's a trophy. Number one nose nuzzle, Champs 98. Azrael, the king's son, heard the human's call. He brought the human back to the castle. There's some story going on. Can I pop this lock? You need both keys to get through. Okay, I thought I only had to pop like one at a time, but alright, we'll do both. This is very reminiscent of the first house we were in. Over time, Azrael and the human became like siblings. The king and queen treated the human child as their own. The underground was full of hope. Second. The fridge is full of unopened containers of snails. It's a trash can. It's full of crumbled up recipes for butterscotch pie. Stove top is very clean. Someone must use fire magic instead. This is Toriel's house. Can I call? Nobody picked up. What about the Pyrus and Undyne? No response from them either? Jesus, okay. Let's pop these doors. Pop these locks. Lock chain. Then, one day, the human became very ill. The sick human had only one request, to see the flowers from their village. But there was nothing we could do.
The next day? The next day? The human died. Azrael, racked with grief, absorbed the human soul, transformed into a being with incredible power. With the human soul, Ezreal crossed through the barrier. He carried the human's body into the sunset, back to the village of the humans. Ezreal reached the center of the village. There, he found a bed of golden flowers. He carried the human onto it, Uh -huh. Suddenly, screams rang out. The villagers saw Azrael holding the human's body. They thought that he had killed the child. Of course they did, because humans are idiots. The humans attacked him with everything they had. He was struck with blow after blow. Azrael had the power to destroy them all. But, Ezreal did not fight back. Clutching the human, Ezreal smiled and walked away. Wounded, Ezreal stumbled home. He entered the castle and collapsed. His dust spread across the garden. The kingdom fell into despair. The king and queen had lost two children in one night. The humans had once again taken everything from us. The king decided it was time to end our suffering. Every human who falls down here must die. With enough souls, we can shatter the barrier forever. not long now. King Asgore will let us go. King Asgore will give us hope. King Asgore will save us all. You should be smiling too. Aren't you excited? Aren't you happy? I don't know what's about to happen. You're gonna be free. Freedom! Uh, save. Yes, let's save. Absolutely save. It's called the last corridor. All right, what's this? Elevator. Where does this go? Oh, this is on the other side of the long walk. All right. Sure. Asgore. So dramatic. It's backlit. That sounds. It sounds, isn't it? You can tell from the fact that it looks like him. So you finally made it. The end of your journey is at hand. In a few moments, you will meet the king. Together, you will determine the future of this world. That's then. Now, you will be judged. You will be judged for your every action. You will be judged for every XP you've earned. EXP. What's EXP? It's an acronym. It stands for Execution Points. A way of quantifying the pain you have inflicted on others. When you kill someone, your EXP increases. When you have enough EXP, your love increases. When your Execution Points increase, your love increases. Love 2 is an acronym. It stands for Level of Violence. Okay, sure. A way of measuring someone's capacity to hurt. The more you kill, the easier it becomes to distance yourself. The more you distance yourself, the less you will hurt. The more easily you can bring yourself to hurt others. But you, you never gained any love. Of course, that doesn't mean you're completely innocent or naive. Just that you kept a certain tenderness in your heart. No matter 
the struggles or hardships you faced, you strive to do the right thing. You refuse to hurt anyone. Even when you ran away, you did it with a smile. You never gained love, but you gained love. Does that make sense? Maybe not. Now, you're about to face the greatest challenge of your entire journey. Your actions here will determine the fate of the entire world. If you refuse to fight, Asgore will take your soul and, huma and destroy humanity. But if you kill Asgore and go home, monsters will remain trapped underground. What will you do? Well, if I were you, I would have thrown in the towel by now. But you didn't get this far by giving up, did you? That's right. You have something called determination. So as long as you hold on, as long as you do what's in your heart, I believe you can do the right thing. Alright. We're all counting on you, kid. Good luck. Okay. Oh, what does it say? Throne room. It's going down here. Oh, what's these? What are these? It's a coffin. There's a name engraved on it. Swarls. Whoa, it's empty. Why does that coffin have my name on it? I'm gonna leave. I'm just gonna go. I'm just gonna go. Is that something you wanna see? It's a coffin with your name on it. Right, let's see. Hello. Dum de dum. Oh, is someone there? Just a moment. I have almost finished watering these flowers. Here we are. Hey, you look like a f male version of the earlier goat person. Howdy, how can I. Oh. I so badly want to say, would you like a cup of tea? But, you know how it is. Nice day today, huh? Birds are singing, flowers are blooming, perfect weather for a game of catch. You know what we must do. When you are ready, come into the next room. I'm gonna go back and save. Here we go. It's a throne. Oh, there's a safe spot right here. What's this? It's another throne covered by a white sheet. Pretty sure Toriel and him are married. Pretty sure she's the queen. Can I call her? I'll be picked up, of course not. How tense. Just think of it like a visit to the dentist. Yeah. 